All right, guys. Uh, okay, here's a uh, the halfway test of, the, uh, of half the exciter system. It's uh, being tested. Only four coils are connected to half the commutator. So, if you look at it in here, I have the bridges, same way. Uh, and it's one, three, four, only four cables that run to the four coils. And all is ground here. All, all coils are grounded. So just like in the negative. And it's, you can see right there. And that's it. This is half uh, of, a, of the generator working. Um, it's obvious that once that I got the eight coils, the, the output is going to be double and the input will be less because it will it will have more resistance, so it will be less amperage. Now, uh, I have a, an amp probe and I'm connecting it to channel blue, channel two, which is blue, and channel yellow, which is one, is connected to the output off voltage readout of the source. This meter right here is just reading the AC uh, voltage output. And right now I got the clamp off. I just wanna go over the... And the input is 14 volts. 14 volts and once that I start spinning the motor, just... Uh, Turning on the motor, it will start generating a signal. Right, right here, it's where it equals the output, more or less. And then, as, as I drive it up, start going. What I like about this system that it stands a high speed and it's just uh, 14 volts. Now I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the, the AC clamp, the probe, and it's, it's set for 10 milliamps, which means one amp in, uh, in the scale. So now both are going to be working, uh, voltage and so we're here 16, 84 and as I turn it higher Anyways, you can see the the wave that it gives at uh, 14 volts and how much I can get in there. Now you can imagine that uh, eight volt, the, the eight coils all together, the whole system pumping in here. This is only one piston here. One piston going that way and, and, and coming back, going back, going back, pumping that way. And I will have, with the other four coils, I have another uh, set of exciter that will work off. When this one is off, this one will be pumping and it's a halfway commutator, you know, exactly divided by 180. And this will be the ramp up of the signal and ramp down. As you can see, I got a jumper here for number four. Number four repeats twice, so it's a little bit more timing in on than the rest of the, the other coils. Anyways, uh, this is it guys. Let me know uh, in the forum, any comments. Thank you.